Okay, this is part two because part one was very sporadic and I did what I didn't want to do. First, I want to welcome uh, Ava Avenue um, to the vlogs. Um, Grandma K, Uncle Mike, Uncle Nick. Um, I know they won't have it till Monday, but I just want to welcome them. Um, secondly, I just want to talk about forgiveness. Um, I know I've talked about forgiveness, but I want to talk about it a little more deeply and a little make a little more sense. Um, in the Bible, if we really want to get deep real quick, uh, Peter asks Jesus, you know, Master, how many times I'm ad libbing us for the most part? How many times are we supposed to forgive? Seven? And Jesus says, no, 70 times 7, which is 490. I did the math with the calculator to make sure I was right. It's 490 times. 490 times. Now, in today's world, how many times people say, I'm sorry, 490, you can probably max out in a year. But you can't... Um, that's not what he meant. He didn't mean 490 times only. And after that, no more forgiveness. No, he meant it's an insurmountable number. And back then, you know. And it's also where confession comes in, binding and loosening of sin. So, um, I want you guys to meditate on that. Um, and meditate on the fact that Forgiveness is not something earned. It's given. Forgiveness. Not for earnedness. You know, people say that respect is given, not earned. I agree. Or earned, not given, sorry. It's earned, not given. I agree. Um, but forgiveness is given not earned and it is hard to forgive believe me they always say um, priests any priest I've ever talked to it's so easy to know that God's gonna forgive you it's easy to forgive others but it is when you have to forgive yourself and let's talk about self-forgiveness self-forgiveness is hard um, I know people who are troubled by sin because they just haven't been able to forgive themselves. Or they, because they can't forgive themselves, they don't think God can forgive them. Which is totally wrong. God can forgive the biggest sinner on their deathbed. He can forgive... If Stephen Hawking... This is a crazy thing. I just, I thought of the most, um... The biggest atheist I can think of, and it's a celebrity society today. If he said on his deathbed, Lord, I sinned, I'm sorry, please forgive me, and had deathbed confession, God would forgive him. Now, when we talk about that there's different, there's many rooms. Um, in heaven, well, God will forgive him, but that doesn't give him a front row seat. You know, Mother Teresa has a front row seat. Um, our Holy Mother Mary has the most front row. She's like on the altar. He would be like in the back, but it'll suffice for him. And he won't know the difference. You know, we got in the discussion in Bible study about that. About where our seats are in heaven. And will, you know, we'd be mad if we don't have a closer seat? No. I think that's a simple... We could have just stopped it. No. Because we're just going to be happy to be there. We're going to be so elated to be at that Mass. It won't even matter. I think you sit with your family. Let's, I'll just go on off in a tangent that I shouldn't. I think how it works is 
you sit with, you know, your immediate, the family, you, you know, your wife and your husband. You sit together. All your kids. But the thing is, we're all interrelated. So do families not matter? But I wonder if we still know the ones that we love. I hope we do. I want to be in heaven. I long to be in heaven with my grandparents. And with my mom and my dad and with um, my sister and brother-in-law and his family and my mom's side of the family and my dad's side of the family and Michelle's family and you know, all, all of you. I long for that. It's hard to admit that because I don't want to die. At the same time, if God was to kill me right now and this was the last thing I did, First of all, I haven't been in confession in a, like, a month, and I kind of need to go because I miss Mass. Um, so, I might be going to hell, but if he forgave me at that point, and he said, okay, Bobby, well, you're still going to get to go to heaven. The joy in my heart would be huge, but would I miss? I, personally, I hope that say, you know, Michelle and I get married, and we live together forever, and I, I die before her, I hope I long for her, I hope I'm waiting, like I do when, for her to get to Mass, I hope I'm waiting, I hope Ben and I can go on a walkabout though he's mad, I hope we can just walk around heaven like it's no big deal, um, to get back to forgiveness though, because God will forgive you, and He'll forgive you so many times, but people say a person can only forgive themselves a number of times. It's hard. Um, hmm. But I want to just say, God is great all the time, and all the time God is good. Well, think about this. You've spent all your life longing for forgiveness, but your parent won't forgive you. But your Heavenly Father will. I know people who are waiting their entire lives for their parents to say, you are a beloved son, or you are my beloved daughter, and you have made me so proud, and you are so awesome, and your faith it inspires me and all these other things and they get wrapped up in all this stuff and they never hear that so pray to God about that meditate on I don't know chapter verse but just type in um, how many times should we forgive somebody like a search engine I'm sure it will come up now, I want to, with, um, I got cut off the first time I tried this. I want, I want to say a prayer. So, if you all pray with me in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Dear Lord, um, please just bless all the readers of this blog and vlog and whatever else you've made this, Lord. Please just lead us all closer to Christ and let us find fellowship in each other. Let us be able to forgive one another for the sins that we've committed upon each other, whether it be rudeness or even adultery, Lord. Let us just be able to find that middle ground, Lord. Um, Holy Mary, Mother God, please nurse us for us as we pray. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Mary, please just help us. All the saints and angels, Saint Sebastian, Saint Michael, Saint Michael, help us defeat the devil. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Father, Son, Holy Spirit. I have like 30 seconds, and I just want to say goodbye to you guys. Um, goodbye. I feed her, Zane. I feed her, and I will just talk to you guys later. And hopefully, this enlightened you. And my rant was fun to get inside my mind because it's crazy I hope that you had fun and I will hopefully be doing some more blogs